Hey guys, how's it going? So today I am just going to quickly tell you guys how um, to make some lice prevention spray. So I use this for uh, Claire. She's our five-year-old daughter who goes to senior kindergarten and we've had several letter letters home from her school saying that there have been cases of head lice. So um, this is such an easy, easy recipe. There are other recipes out there, but I prefer this one because it's just so simple. So I just take a two ounce spray bottle um, and I take essential oils, so I add 10 drops each of my essential oils and then I just fill it up with water and that's it and I just give it a shake and I will spritz um, and I will spritz anything I will spritz her hair her her backpack her coat um, her toque obviously um, the essential oils that I use in mine are is peppermint so I do 10 drops of peppermint I do 10 drops of tea tree oil and then I do 10 drops of clove oil, which is also really good. So I do, so that's a total of 30 drops in a two ounce spray bottle. You can add more if you'd like, you can add less if you'd like, um, but that's what I do. And then I just give it a shake and I spritz away. So just, it's prevention, right? So we want to deter the bugs from wanting to crawl into her hair. Um, and guys, if you don't have clove, that's okay. Just omit it and go with the tea tree and peppermint and you can add more drops of each. Um, if you don't have peppermint, just go with the tea tree. If you don't have uh, tea tree, just go with the peppermint and clove. You get the drift. So just because you don't have one, don't stop there. The essential oils that you do have still will work. So just make sure you use what you have. Um, I just I have clove, peppermint, and tea tree, so I'm going to use all three. So that's all I do. Um, another little thing I do for her too is sometimes she'll get kind of annoyed with me spritzing her hair. This two ounce spray bottle has like the most amazing spritz. I don't know if when you're a DIYer you kind of look for these things, but it has the most amazing spray nozzle. It's it's so good. I just can't stop spraying it. But sometimes I'll just spritz her hairbrush. So this is her hairbrush and I will just douse her hairbrush and then I'll brush her hair in the morning. And then, or else you can just put it on your own finger and then you can rub it around the back of her ears where the mice, the mice, the lice like to sit, uh, the back of the ears or the base of the neck. So um, that's my little tip and tricks. And it's super easy, super fun. Um, and if you've ever had lice in your house, um, you'll want this prevention spray because you know what it's like to get it out. So um, happy spritzing.